Hi, this is Matt with AppliancePartsPros.com. Today we'll be showing you how to repair your appliance. Remember, anytime you work on an appliance, make sure it's unplugged or the circuit breakers are off so there's no chance of electrocution. Also make sure you turn off your hot and cold water supplies. In this video we're going to show you how to change out the GE washer drain hose. It's going to be a very easy repair and it should only take a few minutes to show you how to do it. If you already have one of these, great. If not, you can click on the link below or get it at AppliancePartsPros.com. When you open up the package, you're going to get the new drain hose. The drain hose is what actually moves the water out of the washer into the drain. The main reason you be changing it out is if it sprung a leak and you're getting water on the floor. In order to get the drain hose out, we have to remove the two screws that hold this clip in and then pull the drain hose out. Make sure you lay a towel down. You're going to get some water that comes out when you pull the hose out. We're using our quarter inch nut driver. Here's the old drain hose next to the new drain hose. If you already have one of these, great. If not, you can get it at AppliancePartsPros.com. We do have to take this drain hose clip off the old drain hose and put it onto the new one. We use a small flathead screwdriver and get behind it and pry it off. Once you have it off, all you have to do is slide it onto the new drain hose. To put the part back in, we have to first put the drain hose into its receptor, and then we can put in the two screws that hold in the drain hose clip. Now that you have the drain hose installed, you can insert this end into the drain, plug the washer back in, turn the water back on, and take it for a spin. Thanks for joining us for another successful repair brought to you by AppliancePartsPros.com. Check out our other repair videos on our site, Facebook, and YouTube.